The benefit to the body of good diet and exercise is well known, but as our opinion poll shows, far fewer of us are aware of the benefit to the brain. This experiment at Oxford University puts people over 60 through their paces in the gym for three months, then scans their brains to discover exactly why physical activity protects against dementia. Is it changes in the brain structure? Is it changes in the connections between different brain regions? Is it simply that exercise improves blood flow to the brain? The population of over 65s is expected to nearly double between now and 2050. So it's really important that we're looking into factors that can help promote healthy brain ageing um, or otherwise the incidence of dementia is going to increase um, to even greater levels. The most common type is Alzheimer's disease but dementia has many forms and its causes are complex. Our age and our genes play a role in raising our risk as may exposure to certain chemicals but our lifestyle is the risk factor we have most control over. Indeed, just today, new research was published suggesting a diet high in cooked meat and fried eggs could be linked to a higher dementia risk. Tom Coppins is exercising more and eating better since his dementia diagnosis. He believes people must be taught the potential consequences of unhealthy habits as early as possible. If we can educate children from primary school, you know, say eight or nine years old, whatever, upwards, they're going to grow up knowing what dementia is, and you know how it affects people and how to keep yourself healthy. So we, in theory, should be able to bring up a whole generation of healthy, dementia-free people. I put that idea to the health secretary. We need to do a lot better. I think that uh, young people leave school, they're generally aware of what they need to do to keep their bodies healthy. Um, but we don't teach them very much about how to remain mentally strong throughout their life. And that's not just dementia, it's things like depression, um, other types of mental illness, and, and I think we do need to raise awareness of that. Talk to you and you suddenly got a whole new circle of friends. It's amazing. It's also never too late yeah, to adopt yeah. a healthy lifestyle. Research indicates even once dementia has developed, good nutrition and aerobic exercise like brisk walking improve brain function and memory. Catherine Jones, Channel 5 News.